and from all walks of life. The capital city of Rome had all a mix of all manner of people. And the church was also mixed. He wrote them to understand and know some things in so their hearts. There are big issues. They are one among the He wanted to show them true picture of salvation. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That they may understand this salvation. Our God, the things he does, he doesn't just land on them. He plans for them. He builds them. Like the book of Genesis. It has got the beginnings of many things. There's a start of many things. God is not in a hurry because no one chases him as he starts his things but he can see the end of them so this word of the kingdom of God it was the heart of the Lord it is still his heart today it shall always be his heart no wonder the ghost of our Lord Jesus to the greatest percentage was concerning the kingdom of God. Because that's the heart of the Father. What is the kingdom of God? The kingdom of God is the rulership of God among his people. It is the theocracy, not democracy. See but theocracy. theocracy. The democracy and theocracy. Democracy Democracia is for the people. For the by the people. Yeah. For the people, by the people, for the people. For the people with the people in the people. Ah, I should put this idea here. <laughs> theocracy. But theocracy. God himself is the one ruling among us the sons of From men. From day one when he made Adam and Eve and put them in the garden. Much as complete creation. Even if they are complete creation. Much as indi. Even if in many ways they were dependent on God. How do I break this down? As the grace shall be granted. So Adam ne Eve ne wan kuba do balaba bantu balamba. Even if these are complete people, balabi kanga abe lowo le zabi baga do kulo waza. They think independently. Balabi kanga abe salira woche baga do kola muni milo wali. They can choose to do what they want in the in the in the garden. Na yenge ira katonda ba kose. But God had made them. Mungeri inti in such a way that. Ba ina kuba ako eva tunori la ye. They must look at him for what is next. Look at him for what is next. Eranga kaboni la koruato. As a public sign. He will come down and converse with them. He will come and increase on the knowledge they have. He will come down and check whether they sit on the seat. But that's a big accident happening in the garden. They repaired against God. And the network was cancelled. And they were chased out of the garden. But God still had that that dream. He had, he had a purpose ahead. To restore his system. That he is in charge among the sons of men. He began the nation of Israel. From a historical man Abraham. And he chose him. And said leave your father's house. I will show you. And he said leave your father's house. Abraham should have been very proud. And said, I'm so blessed. Who am I? And God took a deep thing and even began to call him his friend. As if Jordan is only about Abraham. But the larger truth, God is seeing the nation of Israel. 
Amina. Amen. Era je bia gwera. At the end of it all. Katonda chi ali alengera cha tukira. What God wanted came to pass. Egwanga Israeli ne dizali bwa. The nation of Israel was born. Oba ne litandika. It was made. Katonda na zimbo bwa kabaka bwe. The God who built his kingdom. Na sala wa bana ba Israeli. Decided that the children of Israel. Aba tandikize. Let him start. Kunkola nga te baina kabaka. To work without a king. Nga yeye kabaka wa. He was their king. All the nations he permitted them to have kings. As Israel was following this God for many years. And then they said no. Let's make our neighboring countries. Unfortunately. And that time they ahead. When they said they wanted a king. Was a prophet Samuel. And they denied him. He said truthfully. God said don't worry. They are not denied you. They have refused me. I was their king. But now they want another thing. Give them a king. A son of man. But I think like this. You can join me or you can wait. Even if they could not ask for a king at that point. At some point in time. Because God wanted them to have a mentality of a kingdom. God was going to still allow them. To enter into the kingdom of a kingdom. That's what he was. Even if I'm the one who rules in you. You won't understand what I'm talking about. And our Bibles tell us. We don't talk about the kingdom of God. It comes in three ways. It will come. It has come. It was promised. If you're writing them down, write them in that order. It came. It is now. It is coming. One by one. And we shall proceed. It came. Matayo. 12.28. Matayo. 28.28. Matayo. Matayo. Matthew writes to the Jews. Because of the words of Jesus. And this is what he says. Maga maga weba kasuke nyiriri. Okay, atu somera. Our reader, please. Matayo kumina biri abiri munana. Tutandi sene obu wakabaka wakatonda wajja. The kingdom of God came. Agambi atia. What does he say? Matayo kumina biri abiri munana. Matthew 12, 28. Aham. Mm. Kale obu wakabaka wakatonda wajjide. Abantu bali ba mchele kire nanga ba muga anti gogobe mizimu na yelo wa mukuru wa mizimu gogobe ita belzebe. They despise man saying you are casting out demons by the hand of belzebe. Omo yego. The spirit. Na ba ganti na iba anti mu. And said you people. Na yewe mbe mizimu jengo ba jino nji goba kupanga mo yomo chukufuzeno bwa kabaka bwa katonda bwa kolachi. If I cast out the demons by the spirit of God, then the spirit of God has come. Mpane mako esule soko ni la kumi na tano. Mark one fifteen. Mako emo kuminatano. Mark chapter 1 and verse 15. Aha. Mako emo esule emo unyore kuminatano. Onza sile nango ziso mawe ndio kubobu dobu biva jebiva sibulina. Atenga ndiko wenjagalo kutwala. Aha. Gagamba ati. Echisela chituse. Echisela chituse. Obwa kabaka waka tonda buse mbede. Obwa kabaka waka tonda buse mbede. Mwene nye. Mwene nye. Mokirize njiri. Mokirize njiri. So, obwa kaba kobo. That kingdom. Mukama febo yali abala bula ko. The Lord was warning us about. Tibuba sembere. It has come close. Yebo yajja. When he came. Yajja no obwa kaba kobo. He came with the kingdom. Choka atera. Obwa kaba kobo weburi. But that kingdom is also here. Kubange era ba mubuza mwechi buzo. Because they asked him a question. Nivonga kati obwa kaba kabu no weburi wa. He said, where is this kingdom? Na ya nukula. And he answered. Luka kumina musamvu habiri. In Luka. The kingdom of God is now. Uh huh. Luka kumi namsamvu. Hmm. Orinyi yoruabiri. Uh huh. Ruga amanti. We abuzi wa abafalisayo. Hmm. Chowaka baka wakatunda. Hmm. Budjadi. 
Naba dam nagamba mm. anti uh -huh. waka baka waka tunda mm. chevu janga we yole si temu buli nda ndi muda buli ingeda nga buli jindi busembera mm. mm. sote bali bagama anti daba mm -hmm. buli one mm. uba anti buli wali mm. uba anga mm -hmm. lava waka baka waka tunda buli munda ya mwe the kingdom is here present in yes, you. So what you mean is inside us. The rulership of God rules in you. Uh -huh. And say the kingdom of God is coming. Mark 9 1. What what caused David to be risen up? And the kingdom of David. Dawudi, David. In the theological language. A typology of Christ. Is called a chifana Christo. He represents Christ what shall come and show. The kingdom of Show us how the kingdom of God will be when it comes. Ela, and David was a picture to us of how the kingdom of God David was a picture to us of how the kingdom of God Christ shall be. When Christ shall come to rule, where? Here on earth is going to come and rule here. It's called the millennium. A thousand years. The kingdom of God shall be manifest here on earth. And it shall reign here. That's the one I'm saying that is coming. And that's what Mark 9 1 says. Mark 9 1. Mark 9 1. Naba gamba anti. Mm. Mazimamba gamba anti. Kubana mm haba -hmm. imidi dewan. Kubana haba imidi dewan. Wali waba mu. Mm -hmm. Haba talilega kukufana waka tonu. Mm. Kukutusa. Mm. Kulevali la waka 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 tonda. Mm. Ngabuja. Mm -hmm. Na amanyi. Wow. Buge nda kukanga bufawa. From where? Yesu yes, wali kane kanisa. When Jesus had descend with the church. Mu Yerusalem. In Jerusalem. Kurusozi Sayon. On Mount Zion. Okutandi kukufuga millennium. To begin to reign in the millennium. Prophetically chayali avale ingesa. Mungeri yuna be, that was showing them. Nti buge nda kuja. That the kingdom was coming. Kache mde kuga anti buwaja. That's why I said it came. Webuli. It is here. Ate buge nda kuja. And it will come. Ni inga de tunafayo kupa millennium. Before talk about the millennium. Nze nawe sila katuliteke kubuno obuli wakati. Let us emphasize the kingdom now here. Presence that is inside us. Katonda fugira mofe. The God who rules in us. Katonda yagende lero fugira monze na we. Who rules in you and I? Era go kebeno bola mobo. And check your life. The entambo za jobu tambo zamo. The way you're walking with your life. Oro tu gamenti mukama bwacho bwa fugide mobo. Is that how God has reigned in you? Should we say that is the kingdom of God? You handle your spiritual life. The state of your spiritual life. Should we say that is the kingdom of God? That's where the warning of this conference is. That put ourselves in order. Romans 14. 17. Paul warned the Romans. Showing us those who have God reigning in them, they have a certain kind of life that shows the character, that shows the nature, that shows a way that is unique. And at the end of it all, they have peace in them. Of course, everyone is looking for peace. Peace between them and others. They have a certain kind of life that is so unique. This meeting reminds us that when you check your life, you say the kingdom of God is in you. The Baganda life that one settled. 
Amen. 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 The kingdom of God has settled in you. Is that really the kingdom of God? When you examine your life, do you manifest the kingdom of God? Ladies and gentlemen, among men of us, if we are truthful, when you examine you, you see something is missing. The life that you are handling needs to be put right. Amen. Amen. We would say God should fix himself properly in us. But God doesn't need any fixing. He is already perfect. When we talk about his glory, his glory is perfect. He needs to work in a It's already as bright as it needs to be. Amen. Amen. If it is power, you don't see that it is not power. power. The power is already powerful. Why is it not manifested in Why you? Something is still out of order in you. What example can I use? Because it's in Juba. Should I use the sun? When the sun comes up in the noon of the day, you would really say, like it has done whatever it is supposed to do. Amen. Amen. It the light. It has given you light. It has the heat. And even nebuka. It has given the heat. What it must give you. But if somebody is somewhere, and oh, I don't see very well. The things I want to read, but the light is not sufficient. Should we say the problems with the sun? Or oh, it is who has problems with your eyes? Are you still here? Or did you go away? Are you still Two here? You need a few minutes that. before you. Yeah, Praise the Lord. The presence of God. We cannot say that God has not given us His full presence. But if you are walking, but you don't feel the presence of God, it means it is you supposed to put yourself right. Another example. Senga ogenda munsi ziliyeza abana fabali no bunyogo vu proper. If you go to those nations where it is winter. When everybody is covered up in heavy clothing, and then you say, hey, I'm sweating, let me remove some clothes. Everyone is asking, whoever sees you, are you well? Because if you have been, if you are well, and your body is working normally, you should have been feeling the cold. But if you say, oh, for me, I am sweating. In that winter, you are sweating. There is a church truth in your life. Are you still with me? So this kingdom of God, if you haven't seen that it's supposed to be as a church, Church. The problem is not on the kingdom. The problem is with you and I as church to fix our lives. Neighbor is the kingdom of God manifest in your life. Is that how the kingdom of God reigns you according to your life? Should we say that, that that is the whole of God? That's how God has truly manifested this complete This meeting has come for us to put our lives in order. Era Paulo bana abaganti aboluganda temu matira na katono and Paul is telling the brethren do not be satisfied that the kingdom is about eating and drinking it is bigger than that it's even another thing altogether the kingdom of God is the character of righteousness it is about peace it brings peace and settlement it causes rest it creates a new atmosphere. If it is in you, the way you feel must be different. 
your relationship with must be unique and different. You are a man of peace. You are a woman of peace. But you, if you are always in complaining and grumbling, the neighbor is against me. My landlord is against me. My boss doesn't love me. Even the ones who are better than me. Everyone is against you. You have no peace at home. But even in church, you are not a joke. You say, that brother. The way that pastor looks at me. Asha. 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 The problem could be with you because it's at home. Even on the, as you get on a taxi, or any transport you, use. you don't have any peace. Everyone around you is attacking you, you think. Is their heart for you or your heart for them? Is, is that the peace of the kingdom of God in you? Yes, Praise the Lord. Thinking about what I'm talking about. So, the kingdom of God, if it is in us, changes the atmosphere. God has given us a word for the year. As you see, wise. Eh? And the word says, Catch the fire. Keep the fire. Use the fire. Catch the fire. Keep the fire, use the fire. Turn this and over the side here, no? Side, mm hmm. Eh, gentu machi in the same mood. Much are you still here? Uh huh. Use the fire. Ndiko ba wa no? Mm hmm. Catch the fire, keep the fire, use the fire. Nzizeke rude no? Catch the fire, use the fire, use the fire. Yes, we Praise the Lord. Why does it come for us like that? The church has come to a certain place. And we have come cold. And we have been equalized. And the world has equalized us. That our being present in the earth are not being here. They look like they're the same. Let me bring it to you individually. There's a life you had come to. Well, then wherever you are, at the village, where at home, wherever you work, your presence there and your absence, they are the same. What am I talking about? If you have come, or you have not come, there is no difference seen. Why? The one has equalized you. That you look like it. The things you do, the but world does. You have no unique thing different at all. He who us the light of the world. He called us the salt of the world. He looks at us and is in shock. But the world doesn't test our saltiness. He doesn't see our light anymore. Whenever you are a murokole, there is no different whatsoever. If they have in their world the conversations, even when you, they see you they can say hello to you and they continue their great conversations it means you're no longer having an impact among them if you're saying the kingdom of God is reigning in you the world doesn't see let me say it anyway. If they continue their and then you join them, they are not different. They are the same. Now we Amen. There is no salt. In fact, it's now the church salting. The world is salting. Instead of the church salting, the church the church he feels copies a lot. The move of the church of, of the world more than, more than the world copies from the church. Do we think about it? Oh, 
Mbulira ye ngombo ensi jeko ze sanga ya jiko pako kanisa. Give me one saying that the world has copied from the church. You can even call it a slang. A slang. The chili musetani. It way anziza. Thank you. Give me my hand. Eh, at least. Yes, the vinji. But there aren't many. Jokate wo yagalo kujebi ensi ne wojamu mikoro jafi. Even when you come to our functions as a marokole. Over graduation. Graduation, over intro, introductions, over kuchara. You find that there's much, and I want to make people laugh. We have purchased them from the world. With the church. Praise the Lord. Do you understand what I'm saying? Instead of us helping the world, the world is now salting us. Why? We have a picture that the kingdom of God is in us. But the substance, the kingdom is not yet manifest in us. Actually, the kingdom of darkness is in us is ruling in this generation so this great one arises as I'm saying is that the kingdom of God is manifest in you so that you are comfortable that God reigns in me so that you can carry your life on the way it is saying I'll get on fire again Secondly, keep the fire. Kubanga, fortunately, emirundi ne emirundi mukama atuwa do opportunities o kwa to muri. Reno rukonga na rojero na gwe. Rabanji kuma mujia kuba mukoto. Many of us know we shall have fire lit upon us. Amen. If your goodness has been granted. Na yuta mbuzo muri muri rogo week ne gwa kongo chagwe. But to keep the fire for a whole week. How? That's where the challenge is. To keep the fire for a whole month. Ow. That's the challenge. Judges 15. The man is called Samuel, Samson. He died the purpose why he was born. To destroy the Philistines. He even married a wife from there. The prince said, but our son. Our you are you have, don't you have any girl amongst your people and you go to the uncircumcised for you must looking for a reason to kill and them and got the reason in chapter he married and left the wife they had given her away and said uh -huh. now I have a reason to beat all of you my bakos what he did he got that three Hundred foxes. Verse four. Three hundred foxes. Hey, How did he gather them? He he said, I'm coming wow. back. Don't leave. How did you do When we get there, we shall ask Samson. How did you gather three hundred foxes? During the day, usually they have they have holes in which they hide. They are very fearful during the day. They come out at night. They come out at night. But he gathered them. Three hundred of them. They start to be ramba. Secondly, the Bible says that he joined them. They're like dogs. The dog is very peaceful without touching its but tail. But if you play with its tail, mm, it can attack you. Praise the Lord. But this one, pair, two by two, by tail. Thirdly, he set them on fire away in the tails. Number four, he gives them instructions. Go, and you're going to the Christian's gardens. And they obeyed according to his This is the purpose why I brought them. They were set on fire. Secondly, they kept the fire. If they give you a candle to take it to the main from here, if you carry it and still on fire when you get there, you are very careful. You can't usually find a dog that's not about Most of them run. Run. Isn't that so? I want to think they were also running. But they kept the fire. Number five. Number five. 
The last thing they used the fire. I'm praying for you in the name of Jesus. That during this conference today, remind the kingdom of God. May God set you on fire again. The fire of the kingdom. And keep that fire burning in you. And then use that fire to do the purpose of the kingdom. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If the kingdom of God reigns in us, there must be signs that, show that the kingdom of God is present. But if you are truly truthful and you look at your life, we talk about the spiritual life first of all. What are the signs? Is that the kingdom of God? That mindset that you have in you, is that the mindset of the kingdom? Praise the Lord. The character that you carry is that the true character of the kingdom. Your behavior in Chilokolezo is that the kingdom of God. Is that the true picture of God reigning in you? Is that how God uses you? Is that how God manifests in you? Friends, we can have a hunger for it. But, but many of us, what we have presently is still lacking. Amen. Praise the Lord. So this meeting has come for us. I said, Yes, he is the king. He has no problem. His kingdom. We in which it reigns, we must fix ourselves. Amen. Amen. We must put ourselves in order. If you look critically, it's like we have we allow it a little to reign in us. But it is raining on a temporal basis. In such a service as this, everybody allows the kingdom to reign. If you wanted to measure depending on the service, most of us can go. But when we step outside, when we go back, in our life we spend most of our time. It looks like we put the king away from us. There things we must deal with here. It looks like. System we, put, we pause the system of the kingdom and then the kingdom of all takes over and then we find you out there when you are another person together, the language is different the mindset is different the way you do things is different getting ready to come to church you switch on this kingdom system you allow the kingdom now to come even you reduce your voice here. Here you speak very humbly. You, you can even have a stereo in you us. You reduce the bass. And then you set yourself. You can see a child of the kingdom here. Praise the Lord. But the one who set up that system. He designed it to rule. Everywhere. Because his purpose so that he is manifested through you that it may be hard and seen in you. Others. The fire on which he is setting us does not help you, not only you, but to help others through you. 
Because we are talking about the fire of the Holy Spirit. For those who train in you, He helps you. But heaven says that He's going to go through you. He's going to go through you to help others. Jesus went to pray. And found the devil praying. He listened to the devil's prayer. He was praying for his disciples. Said, God, give me these men. Give me to test them. Let me wait for them. Jesus said, The Father and the Father was about to accept the, the, the devil's yes, prayer. Jesus also prayed. He said, Father. Kale wandi bango kuenda kuganya setani abu wabantu wana. Devil to sift my people. Neye wachi di petero. But Peter. Wachi di mo mo. At least this one. Wachi di ono mo. At least this one. Na akoma una agamba petero. Ndi jembadi Peter. Ndi jembadi ni sanza setani ya sabo. I found the devil in a prayer. Neye kwe mkusabi. But I prayed for you. Kati kwe mo malo kuteni. After you are strengthened. Uyamba baganda bo. Help your brother. Ngaringa mkanti obwa kabaka obu mala gokuli ya. Other the kingdom has ruled in you. Kati atebu yitene mugwe bu yambe na abalala. And help others as well. Otege de jesu cha atu sabira. That's what Jesus is praying for us. Kati katonda tabala kuloko la gwe we. They don't want to save you only. Katonda tabala bu akabaka kuwangu la gwe we. God doesn't want to overcome you as a kingdom only. Atandi sena awe. He starts with you. Na ya ya gala buole buole seza mugwe. To manifest it through you. Ebe so that others are helped. That's why he prays that you are the light of the world. And when I have a statement, no one lights a candle and then covers it with a bucket. Everyone who does that lifts it up so that they can shout to all those who are near. You're like a city up on a city. The lights of it can see from far. So, the kingdom of God to come in you. God is spending on you to help others who have not yet come. Neighbor, neighbor there is not true with fruit. And it eats its own fruit. Every tree that has got fruit in the world is for other people. There is no fenna that needs itself. It wants you to bear fruit. Not for you to eat. For others to enjoy them. But sadly, you're not on God's purpose. For you are on you. God me. God help me. Working in me. Dealing with me and enter heaven. For me, if I can go through heaven said, what is wrong with this one? That's a half prayer. Others should go through because of you. Praise the Lord. The kingdom of God. He wants us to sort the earth. And go to appoint Israel. And call it his firstborn nation. They are saying. 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 If he's the king of Israel, he wants to rule over Israel only. He wants to rule all. He wants to manifest through Israel. So, when he saved you, not just you alone, he wants to use you to reveal himself to others. And he has to challenge you and allow the kingdom of God to grow in you. Such a big way that another one wants to enter it. So, neighbor, the kingdom of God in you, if it doesn't challenge anybody, 
to come and join it. Oh, mm, you are bad love. Can a statement you choose a moment? I mean, nay, nay, a chitanga, a chakira, a light shining in you. Is not shining to such a great level. To light your neighbor. Then teaching Nayakanga, which it is bright enough. The presence of God in you. If it hasn't increased. Kutandi kakuyamba balala bakuri nanyi your neighbors then o chali bubi mm -hmm. you are still bad love akula biki denga bidoboza are they thinking about what you said obo you get a rudicha oh you are speaking arabic yibazwe mukam praise the lord so but it we take we take better when we do examine ourselves we haven't come to certain places. That your presence and your absence are the same. I will tell you again if I did before. If you miss a church here for a whole week. And nobody calls you. The pastor, I won't even talk about you. Begin to examine seriously. Maybe in that church, you haven't come to a certain place. Let's talk about your home. If daddy you miss home just three days and everything goes on as normal. Nobody is concerned, nobody is worried. Hey. Ask yourself, you haven't put a certain power in that home. Mami. Okay, mommy. Mommy, no, mommy you miss home. Week in a whole week. And no one, no one is then says, Where are you? Everybody is happy. In fact, they even oh. say, ah. She's not here. There is a problem. But, but there should be something. Oh. Oh, daddy, oh, daddy is not here. <laughs> value it makes a difference but if they are equal your absence and our presence are even at place of work we are not there everything runs normally no one misses you you know there's a problem here. It must be that when you are upset, they ask where is he call him? Where is he find him? Did you call them? What happened? Are they sick? Are they dead? What is the problem? Your presence makes a difference. Back to the kingdom of God. He who made you and I. That's how his culture is. He has begun with you. So let him manifest through you to the generation which you are. But if you begin that you are saved but your being saved has no impact at all. Not at home. Whatever your place of work where you spend most of your time nothing is made you know you have a problem God is not shining in you as yet you are still hindering him from shining in he said he has no problem but are you are the vessel you are the one who is lacking you need to put yourself in order Amen. Amen. The kingdom of God is the rulership of God inside us. But when we examine ourselves, should we be convinced? Should we rest? That certain other God rules in me. That's how the world has seen him reigning in me. This meaning is warning us that there's something bigger. Inside you, there is another one. In you, in you, in you, in you, in you, in in you, in you, in you, there is another you that the world is waiting for in you there is another you that can manifest the glory of the kingdom of God in our generation hallelujah the snake has many shocking facts about it but one of them I don't know whether they all do that 
But a snake knows how to shed its skin. Was understood that part. The shedding of the skin. Who has understood that? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. The snake comes to a certain point in life. And said, no. This skin is not me. I'm still me. But the way I look, ah. Mm -hmm. It doesn't work anymore. And gets a certain way. Gets a place. And shades of that skin. And get south of it. Still the same. But now there is a new one. In this meeting. You need a time. And a shade. In the spirit. You get out of this meeting. Wherever you are going. They shall begin to speak in whispers. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This year, there are those who speak whispers. joy to hear them. What happened to her? But these days, praise the Lord. Those who are gossiping good about you. If they are gossiping like that, mm -hmm. let them continue. But every gossip about you is impossible. This should be a wonderful, enjoyable gossip Amen. about you. They're speaking about you. But they're speaking the uniqueness about you. Moses left the mountain. And they began to talk again. Until they showed up. But the truth is, Moses, cover your face. But we are dying. We can't look at your face. We are in Northern Ireland. We in Northern Ireland. Many years ago, with the, the white men in Michigan. They were speaking, saying, When you look at us, we see that you are seeing our our eyes are penetrating us. See our secrets. They told us, Not one, not two. But you men, when you look at us, you are seeing the depth of us. Praise the Lord. Was that in the flesh? Praise the Lord. That was coming in the spirit. It feels that you are seeing them penetratively. Praise the Lord. But something must be manifested. That is the way God wants it. Why He saved you early? He wants to give you heaven. I want to leave you here. He wants He to be manifest in you to others. But are you satisfied? That that's how he has manifested himself through you. Neighbor, are you satisfied really? How many have seen him in you? How many have heard him through you? How many have repented? Those who have lifted up their former life. Because they have seen God in you. They have heard God in you. Or... They are even charging. I will never be born again. That's Morocco behaving like that. That's why I tell you I can't get saved. Hmm. There's a scripture in the Bible. It says, If there is a darkness in your eyes, if light is now darkness, but it's something of the kind. We can be under the light. What should have been light is now darkness. In other stories, about the opposite. They are going backwards. Can you say in Nakuzang? This church. It's like 
who have been challenging others to get saved now we are chasing them away from being saved to the Pharisees you're standing in the doorway you're not entering but you're also hindering those who are trying to enter but that's where we are going to why the kingdom of God has not been shown in us but I pray for you that get the fire keep the fire and use the fire Hallelujah. Hallelujah. May God help you. Take others out of it and put yourself in it. Because God's calculation is you as an individual is depending on you. That he saved you early so that he can reveal himself to you. So that you know him and understand him and build a relationship with him and to grow until those who are outside your life can see that God in you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The family is waiting. They see nothing. When we were told the story, This thing, this thing about him there is fire I can burn you in time the animals I can burn you you, you see this red fire on me it so was a fire at the end of the day the fire there was no fire in the village what do we do there is no fire until they gathered let's, let's go to Mr. Sekwang Mr. Koko can give us give us some fire on his head let's say we shall go there he can burn you let's go we shall explain me what we do let's make a chain and do in your hands the last one will talk to this one. When the fire is upon us, for us, you can pull him out. They made a chain. <laughs> the last one, when he came to this court, he was asleep. The problem has come. He's sleeping. We must wait for him to wake up. He said, no. Why should we wake up? Let's say, get some grass. And just get the fire. And for us, we go. What if he wakes up? It's only carefully. We are putting us together. <laughs> there was there any fire? There was no fire. There was no fire. There was no fire. And he woke up. I'm burning you. They said, Wapi. All the animals were laughing. Is <laughs> the one who ran away from the village. We can call fire. 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 Call May God help us to get the fire, the fire and use the fire. That's how we shall make a difference. Leviticus 6, verse 13. Our Bible says, The Lord said to Moses, Tell the high priest Aaron to tell his sons that his sons leave. They should never let the fire run down on the altar. Let them Ignite the fire again fire burn continuously. That picture of the temple of those days represents you and I today. Amen. Amen. Bakolin says, so Kasat Kumina Mukaga Gamba. Haven't you known? You are the temple of God. And the spirit of God rests in you. 
those who are the physical altar we have spiritual, spiritual altars who have the kingdom of God they were saying don't let the fire burn out we are encouraged to keep the fire of the spirit our life is shining every day the kingdom of God is raining in us there must be a non-ending fire there must be an altar on fire there must be fire continually the agents don't speak much former agents of the devil but they say this almost all the time. A true Morocco in the spirit. They are burning. You see them from far. They are not easy to attack. Because in the spirit they are on fire. They are burning. But a weak Morocco. Who has the name of the kingdom. But they don't have it. It's not raining in them. They are dark. Boliza neighbor and nay, nay, Kazikiza, darkness, over Molido, or fire, or Golimogu, in you. Take a deche so say. I know what he has spoken. Nessi be a queso, but it's not about choosing. Yaku gained it. It's intention. It is intention. If you can't keep the fire burning in you, you shall always set the fire. You continue to keep the fire. Paul the fire Timose, told Timothy, you have the gift. But start it up. You will find your gift. You find you find it. It. When you see the big difference. When we use candles in the old church. Everybody had a candle. The first one said on fire. Then everybody had a candle. Was given a lot of shit in the fire. Shit in the fire. Then when we use candles in the old church. 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 You can challenge. You you what shall we do? May God help you this year. Those who come to you and ask you, what can I do? Their question has come to the post. You have the solution to their lives. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You have the answer to their lives. Because you have something they have seen that they don't have. Praise the Lord. But if it is you running to them, Mama, so I want to stop you. I need you seven. I want to see you. The Lord is going to find wisdom. I don't know how you're going to help me. No, 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 Come on, stand your feet and talk to your God. Two, three, four minutes. Say, Lord, that's how you made it. Make it like a fire. Lord, that's how you made it. 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 I open up my heart. Lord, rain. I open my life. Shining. I give myself to you. 
I want to ride on you. So that I can take you to the nations. I want you to come on me. So that I introduce you. To those who have my day. Here I am. I open myself to you. Yes, oh, I forgot. Yes, Yes, forget, forget, yes, forget, yes, forget, yes, yes,
Mukama sobolo kukoleza Mukama sobolo kusukiza Mukama sobolo kudiza Echo mubiche ya liya zikiza Echo mubiche ya liya nafuya Echo mubiche ya liya kubako Mukama chinko mesewo Mukama demu akubagule Wabere wabulamu Wakati mwabulamu bo Wabere wechisa Echigati wakuchisa Chewala vya maso kamu kama Wabere woku wangati nwa Nebu kumuliri Nebu kumuliri No mukona kwa katonda Wabere woku kolo kose mwa Momotu wa wamunda Mukama kukolo kosa Woku fukira mukwe Mukama tuwale chifoti Mukula kumwo Mukwa kama kamwe Mufukire mukwe Buna kuchula mundo wosa Nebu uliki kamu njokera Buna kuchula mundo wosa Nebula vikina mubi okola Buna kuchula mutima Nebula vikina mubi okola Mbo wangu duwa Mbo wangu duwa mudayo Mbo wangu duwa 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 Asomoro kufuga Ia tegeka kufuga Ia kone saini nga kufugira Ia kulo unga mwati Nga ye ya kendo kula vikira mkwe Ensite no nyakwe Ensite nindini ndekwe Ensite yeta agakwe Ensi yeta agakatonda kulimu Ensi nindini ndekatonda mwolina Ensi no nyakatonda mwolina Ensi ya kalakuli na katonda mwolina Ensi ya kwe no nyakwe Ensi ya kwe Ensi ya kwe no nyakwe 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 Na yeri yo manjava na yambibwa Atandi senawe Na yeri yo manjava gendo kutoroka Oku yita mukwe Ganyo mwaka waka webo je Elabo fukire mukwe Nga yesu wea tuingini so kusaba Na gani musabe Tio mwaka waka webo je Elabi kone mwene monsi wano Nga mwene kone mwene mkuru Mokama Leko mwaka waka webo je Mufukire monsi Mufukire monsi mukama Newayo Nekula wo Mbuganya Mbuwambe Mbuganya Mbutwale Echifecho monsi Nekula wo Nzuno Ngabo watesa Mwechibachimba ko Ngabo wakenderera Nzuno Kwela visibwa Nzenfawo Kwela visibwe Nzenzi kakana Kukuru misibwe Nsuno Mokama nyamba Mokama nyamba Mokama nyamba Tata nyamba Nsaba kuyambiwa Tata nzikiriza Nzikiriza Chewa wala chendiko Chewa tesa chendiko Chewa kenderera chendiko Yimuse ndobo zelio Genda maso sabi Genda maso yongere na ye Genda maso sabi Mokama kuyambe Oyambi bwe Nyali ya yeso Yemose jobo serio Manyi Jolukonga naru Mokama ya kwele tende Asoboro kuyamba Kena maso mugambe mukama nyamba Mukama ni targeti sacho Mukama nyambo la visiwa muze muli nyeri ya yesu Christo mnazales Nange navele chitanga leri abalala Nange navele omunyo kwensi katonda wange Oh, moyo mtu kubutonde ka Nonako nange mukama Tuwa manyi kabaka baka baka Otu jembo nafu wafene mbugaya la kwa fetata Otuwe bakide tabaza za fe mukama anga zizikide Otu koleze ya kubuto umuliro kwa umulinye ya yesu Uwe bale mukamo rechi gambo cho Thank you, Lord, for your because you sent me to the last. Thank you, Lord, we give you all the glory and honor. Thank you, Lord, we give you all the glory and honor. Tugolole mikono jafetuwe baze katondo romzana we Master we thank you for Pastor Joshua Zake And you cover him more in your blood May you fetch him further and faster in Jesus' name We cover him under your mighty wing 
in your hands, Lord, we put him and his entire household and the ministry of you, Sisi Buaise, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Welcome back from that session. We want to thank you all those who have just joined us. Please take your seats. Thank you so much for coming. Many churches are still joining us. May the good Lord bless 